Hey guys, it's Lexi. Welcome back to another video. I have been wearing loafers so often lately, so I thought it would be really fun to do a little bit of a styling video for you guys. This video is going to have a mix of outfits for kind of any season. Transitional spring weather is upon us, so I kind of did an emphasis on those kind of outfits, but basically any of these could be carried into fall, winter, spring, or summer. It's pretty flexible. I will be styling two loafers throughout this video. The first pair will be the ones on my feet right now from 80s. I love these so much. I wear them, like I said, really often. So I thought it would be fun to show you guys how I've been rocking loafers lately. This first pair that I just showed you is really classic. And then the second pair that I'll be styling are a little bit more edgy and out there with the platform. These are from Ghani. They were my first pair of loafers and I love them so much. If you have the budget for it, the Chanel loafers are like on my radar right now and I'm obsessed with them as well as the Prada loafers. So those are a few options for you guys, but you can really wear whatever kind of loafer you want. Those are just some of the pieces that I think are really cool right now, but let's get into styling and we'll start with what I'm wearing right now. Coming at you from a new angle in my apartment. Let me know what you guys think or if you prefer the old angle better. So let's get into this outfit breakdown. I'm wearing the 80s loafers that I showed you just a few minutes ago. And then some Feel Studio ink shorts and then a rag and bone top that is unbuttoned towards the bottom. I just like having my button ups when they're not tucked in, uh, a little bit looser towards the bottom because I think it's fun when you're walking, you can see a little bit of stomach. And then also it's very clear that I am wearing pants underneath this because otherwise, you know, it's the no pants look. This is my absolute favorite pair of shorts. It's the perfect length, not too short, but also not too long. It's perfect for the summertime. I love an all white look for the summer, especially with a tan. It's very cute. I'm not wearing a bag with this look, one, because I don't have the perfect shade of white to match the outfit, but also I don't want to take away from this relaxed vibe that I have going, and I feel like a bag makes things a little, a little bit more serious and less playful and effortless than I want to go for. I love how the white in the bottom of the shoes just brings everything together, and if you did want to make this look a bit more Mew Mew-esque because we all know it's Mew Mew season right now. If you watched Paris Fashion Week at all, you know that Mew Mew completely killed it. So you could definitely shorten your top because we know tiny, tiny tops are in. That's what they were doing on the runway. So here's a little bit more of a summer adaptation of this look. It's very fun and flirty. Got your stomach playing into everything and you're just ready and on trend with things. Let's get into the next outfit. This is my adaptation of a French girl look. So I'm just wearing a pair of basic jeans and then a white t-shirt and some loafers. I think this is a little bit more fun than your typical white tee and jeans look. I like how the pop of white ties in with the pockets and then also my shirt on top. This is a Marc Jacobs t-shirt. I'm wearing some Margiela jeans on the bottom and I would probably wear a fuzzy bag with this look. If I wanted to wear a bag, this is the one I would wear. It's very fuzzy and holds a lot of stuff. It's from Unif. This is pretty much my everyday kind of look and it's a very easy way to style loafers that isn't very uptight. Sometimes loafers can be mistaken for just a piece of clothing that is there for the more preppy individual. But I think this outfit um, completely proves that wrong. You can style loafers into any kind of vibe. This is how I like to style my loafers when I'm going for a more clean look. Just wearing an all black basic outfit. Um, my jacket is vintage Escada. My tank top is from Totem and then Totem <laughs> and my jeans are from the Feel Studio. Then my bag is Givenchy. I like this because one, it's all black, so it's just a no-brainer. You throw on all of your favorite black clothes, and then obviously your loafers, very classy, and will stand the test of time. 
My favorite little detail here is how the jeans are straight legged and the top of my foot is just barely peeking out from my shoe. I think it's a nice little touch of skin where everything else is pretty covered and I think that is the beauty of a loafer. You can bring a little ankle into your life. <laughs> Here's another all black outfit for you guys. This time with a pair of flared jeans. Flared jeans are my favorite way to wear platform loafers. I love wearing loafers with a pair of flared jeans, especially when they have a platform because it just makes your legs look so much longer and don't we all just want legs for days? So these are Levi's jeans, an attire, the studio sweater, and then a random I love New York baseball hat because I wanted to bring in a little pop of color to this look. It's very cozy and I think it's also very chic, but the loafers at the bottom definitely bring in a little bit more pizzazz because the sole is very unique. Yeah. We've got a big vibe change for this outfit here. This will be what I'm wearing all summer. A slip dress and some loafers. Just add some sunglasses and a bag and you're ready for your day. This look to me is everything because you don't have to think. You just put on one item, your everyday accessories, and your loafers. And it is just very cute and easy things that I always like in an outfit. So this is just a realization par dress. I'm wearing my bag from earlier and then some square sunnies from Versace. I don't have a pair of cat eye glasses but I feel like that would be even better here just to kind of edge the look up a bit more. Here's a nice little summer adaptation for the loafer and you can even bring this into like a fall winter kind of vibe. So let me show you. All you need is a nice little warm jacket that ties into the colors of your dress. I'm not wearing any, but just throw on some tights and then you're ready for the colder seasons. This little cropped kind of trench-ish jacket is from Hyder Ackerman. This is how I style loafers for a bit more of a street style vibe. I throw on a pair of baggy more low-waisted denim and then a cropped little mini tank. This one's from Dre and then my jeans are off-white. This is probably the comfiest outfit ever. Just legs are free and you know loafers are on. I like this look because of its juxtaposition. You're wearing just like the miniest tank and then a pair of baggy jeans but you're wearing loafers which are more preppy but they really aren't and I think that's the fun of this look. I have one more outfit to show you guys. I could go on and on about how to style loafers for probably 30 more outfits but since we don't have all the time in the world I'm going to conclude the video with this final look and of course you've got to remember that loafers with mini shorts and tights just look amazing. I would say it is arguably a better look than with uh, heels. So I'm just wearing this blazer that I thrifted, the same tank top from earlier, and then these shorts are from Ira Paris. <laughs> kind of funny how they like V at the belly button. I honestly could have put on a longer shirt, but I didn't feel like it, so... Here is the outfit we've ended up with. Got a nice little pop of gray going, and obviously the star of the show, the loafers, which make your legs look very, very nice. I think everyone needs a pair of platform loafers in their wardrobe, and if you're not convinced after watching this video, I don't know what to do to convince you of it. I hope you enjoyed the video and that you found another way to style your loafers or maybe now you want to go out and buy a pair highly recommend it I wear mine all day every day and they're just the best shoe ever <laughs> all right I'll see you guys in the next video goodbye